I love how like that that was just a I'm actually really excited because they're talking about doing the Gears TV series. And I'm excited for Batista Batista to like Dawn Marcus. I think that's actually could be really, really cool. Instead of doing the tickers here. Oh, that's... I forgot about that. That's new. And it's honestly... It's one of those things here I think is truly weird. Um is that the the locust like hive mind you think that the the, the lambent wouldn't have as strong uh, but we notice like in the in, in if you read the comic the the rise of rom if you read uh and you play two you start to learn like the locusts are are fighting the lambent as well as uh no not fighting you as well as as the humans so it's really this like call between war. It's the same thing that really did damage to the uh, God. I don't know any force. Like it did damage to Japan in World War uh, Two. Thank you to Dan Carlin's Hardcore History. You guys need a good podcast to watch. Highly recommend it. I'm listening to Supernova in the East right now, which is all about uh, Pacific theater, but kind of the Japan side. Welcome to what's left of the cog. I'll have answers for you, ladies and gentlemen. But later. I need to see Colonel Hoffman immediately. Hoffman's been gone almost as long as you have, Chairman. He's dead? He left to take a group of civilians to Anvilgate. Captain Michelson's the senior officer now. Not that we have much of a military left. I'd better talk to the gallant captain, then. I have a mission for him. Oh, and Sergeant Phoenix, you'll want to see this. Fucking Onyx card. Be a shopping list. Let's go check it out. <laughs> Who the hell does that asshole think he is? Prescott's gonna find out an ex chairman doesn't count for shit with Michaels. Action stations, land We just took down. Let's go, people. The sooner we kill these things, the sooner we get to see I see and find out what's so important on this goddamn dent. Yeah, the the like oh god. The 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 glowing stuff, I should have actually not like gone down there. And I like the fact that they chose, hey, the reason the design aesthetic for uh, going with the short sleeves is like the cog, as they said, everything's kind of been dismantled now. So nothing worked. The regime fell. The regime wasn't able to um, wasn't able to protect the the company, the world, the, the their people, things like that. That's typically how fascist regimes go down, or any sort of regime is like they are not able to protect someone, something, somehow, some way, uh, in in that order, and they they get torn apart. Typically from the inside, uh, you got a lot of military interactions. You've got different things such as that. Uh, and then you know the people are now so disenfranchised. The military loses faith. Uh, you know, hey Mark, Colonel Hoffman left, um, and he took civilians to go to Anvil Gate. I'm guessing he thought it was going to be like a better idea, whereas this is supposed to be like the last military holdout, if I'm not mistaken. We'll try it. We will try it, guys.
I'm not saying it's going to go well, but we're going to try it. You know, one of those games that you're supposed to play with friends, but you need to have friends to play with you to do this. So I, I enjoy that it's like, hey, we have a scientific approach to possibly end this. Uh, I think it's actually really, really good. That sucks. Prescott can't handle shit. Yep, yeah, no, I, I really need to put this down. This is this is our, our, our weekly reminder that uh, I am not meant to have a sniper rifle. At all. I'm shooting about as well as the people did on my Gears Tactics stream. Go watch that, guys. We just want to have a good laugh. Where's that Nasher? There was a Nasher over here, wasn't there? Because I dropped it. Oh, hey, I can just pick up more long shot ammo. More of something we don't need to see. All right, let's. We'll, we'll grab a Nash when we find it. Now, one of the things that I also like here is this is the start of what it's like. Hey, let's make the 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 rep the the weapons like turn red as you're firing them to show hey that these things have been they're, they're getting hot they're they're not just uh, some static uh, weapon here that they like there's there's consequences there's damage to them uh, it is one of like my favorite points of uh of this game series is when they started adding that in there like it just starts to glow that tip just glows red it just yeah that looks so good. But yeah, one of my questions is always like, okay, the lambent, you think, because like the emulsion, I always treat that like the, the, the nuclear weapons, right? So nuclear weapons, uh, after they were kind of the, the advent of them and they, they started really becoming uh, available out there, what really begins to happen is like the genie comes out of the bottle. We get, of course, nuclear weapons, nuclear power. Uh, but the idea of nuclear war, it's something that's like, you know, th th this is capable of, of like destroying us uh, many times over. And once it's out, you really can't put it back. Uh, and here with uh, there it is. Not the Nasher. If we're going to go underground, it's one of those things where it's like, just, just grab the Nasher. It's going to be more beneficial to you. Okay. 
but the and the idea that it's like okay you know irradiated people that is something that we do need to worry about uh it's not it's not just a but it, it, it always seems like a way to make people weaker there is no such thing as like okay we we got enough of radiation ir, ir, radiation in us and now we are strong like that has never happened And I do also like the fact that, like, hey, no, there's a fire. We need to, we need to deal with this because, like, that is one of the biggest threats on any uh, warship. Uh, when they tell you, like, hey, everybody is a fire uh, in the on the on an aircraft carrier. That is one of the things that you go through basic training when you're in the uh, when you were in the navy. Is like you get your fireman training. You have to uh, because that happens on the ship. Like you spell death for your people if you haven't been able to take it. If you can't. You know, rectify that situation. You know, you're talking about loss of oxygen. You're talking about the fire itself, all the other gases, anything else that could possibly happen. If there's anything close by to you as it's happening, all of that could, you know, be in jeopardy because of a fire. Like how weak he even sounds. Almost like whiny. Phoenix, get down to the hangar. The helicopters are under attack. We need to get them airborne right away. Are you wounded? Yes, but then I... Then you stay here. And you don't move until we get back. Understood? I'll try not to get myself killed, Sergeant. Yeah, you do that. I'm not the conversational type. But when I get back, I want a nice long chat. I'll come back and give you first aid as soon as we've got the choppers away, okay? We should have handcuffed him to a pipe, in case he does another disappearing act. He's not going anywhere without his chopper. <laughs> <laughs> 